Welcome back, Tangerine Tagalongs. I'm Jordan. And I'm Maddie. And we are Tangerine Travels. We are back in our previous Airbnb from a week ago. So, 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 so excited! We love, <laughs> love, love this place. We booked it again for another week. It is by far our favorite place that we've ever stayed in all of Mexico. At every city that we have been to, when we got here, it just kind of felt like home. It was clean, it had a lot of light. Laska could run around outside and sun herself downstairs, but then also we could leave the door open and she can't get down because she's afraid of the spiral staircase. <laughs> <laughs> Comfortable bed, our own bathroom, our own kitchen, everything we could want in a place. It is safe. We have a place to put our car that's inside gates. Our host, Anna, is amazing and kind and bubbly and just a great person to be around. And it's in a great location, a few blocks away from Avenida Chapultepec. And where... lots of other restaurants too. And our mango guy. <laughs> Last guy, you shed so much. <laughs> Dad, don't touch my tail. Gosh, you you're embarrassing me. You wanna go for a walk? Last guy. Whoa. Say hello. 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 We're going for a walk. Hola. Hola, buenas tardes. Nos gustaría mango con limón y tequila, por favor. Hope you guys saw that. This is why we can't take her anywhere. Last time this happened, she jumped up on a cart full of cocadas and we <laughs> licked one of them. <laughs> licked one of them. We hopefully bought the one that she liked. <laughs> Unconfirmed. No, that was good mango. This is 30 pesos, 30 pesos, and it's pretty much the equivalent of like one and a half really, really big mangoes, or probably two and a half small ones. But we'll stop there. The list of reasons why we love this place is just incredibly long, but it does sort of have a little something to do with some news that we have to share. And that news might have something to do with the noise That's you outside. Hear. So please excuse all of the crazy loud sawing and hammering and other things that might be coming upstairs. Before we had left this Airbnb the last time, I was getting separation anxiety before we even had left. I was like, this is the best place we've ever stayed. We seriously cannot leave. I don't want to leave. Don't make me leave. Please don't make me leave. I went on Airbnb. Let's see what availability she has for this room because the week afterwards there was some dates that were not available and that's why we had to go somewhere else for a week. I'm like, what does she have after that? Can we book a month? Can we book two months? Can we book the rest of my life? <laughs> okay, not that long. But there wasn't enough availability in this particular room, but I noticed that she had another room that just had no availability on that whatsoever. It was just some other part of the house. So we thought, what the heck? Let's ask her about it. Maybe it could be available. It just needs to be cleaned or something. We posed that question to her. We're like, hey, we would love to stay here. We noticed that you have this other room. What's the situation on that? She said she had been procrastinating and remodeling it, but she sounded really interested that we wanted to rent it longer term. We came to an arrangement. We're not going to tell you what it is exactly quite yet. We're going to save that until we actually move in there and give you guys a tour. That construction you hear outside is for our remodel room that we're going to be staying in. And we'll give you a little teaser of where we're going to be staying. Just be forewarned, it's under construction. We don't even fully know what this place looks like, so that's a little bit crazy, but we had a a little walkthrough where we saw that it had what she described as the, the area for the future kitchenette. There's a little uh, living room area, a balcony. You go up the stairs and that's where the bedroom is. We also have our own private bathroom. And again, there's a lot of light coming in. It looks like a really great space. And then of course, we have all the same things that we loved about this place, the safe neighborhood, the covered parking. It's gated, Laska has somewhere to run around and to hang out on her own balcony. So we were absolutely stoked. It was like, oh my goodness, if this can be ready in a few weeks, totally. Even if it's not ready, I mean, if there's a few things that need to be done still, I think we were both like, the concept of apartment hunting and maybe trying to find someone who could co-sign. So that's our exciting news. We informally made an agreement with Anna that we were gonna be renting the room upstairs for two whole months. We prepaid to get a little bit of a better deal that way. Again, we'll go into more of these details when we give you the, the full walkthrough when everything is all done. 
But we are so, so thrilled to be staying here in Guadalajara for the next two months, starting next week. Are you excited to stay here? Are you excited to stay here? travel throughout Mexico going from place to place to place just exploring the country for three months four months six months or until we found somewhere that we really really wanted to stay well, we thought we were going to go all the way down to southern Mexico the last place we thought we would end up staying for a longer period of time is a place right in the middle of the country Guadalajara you know when we were first considering traveling through Mexico we saw a youtubers video who was living in Guadalajara at the time and I don't know I first thought about Guadalajara okay you know what if I tell you this don't you dare unsubscribe don't you dare I will never tell you a secret again in my mind I thought Guadalajara was like a jungle with mud huts or something I had absolutely no idea anything about the city at all so to think now that we're gonna be spending the next two months here or maybe more time is crazy there's no mud huts by the way <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm glad or disappointed. <laughs> no, but it's a beautiful place. We're just like, uh, I, I'm speechless. We're, we're so excited to start this next new different journey. We can feel it that there's just amazing things on the horizon. Hopefully you will join us on this journey. There is going to be some shenanigans ahead. I just know it. If you would like to continue with these shenanigans and be a tangerine tag along, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. <laughs> <laughs> Go on that bell so that you get notified every time we put out a new video about our adventures and travels in Mexico. See you tomorrow. Hasta luego.